Did I rehearse my lines? Do I even remember them? I know I can't remember things. Why did I do this? He just looks so great. And they agreed to create a story with him. There you are. Everyone's taking their seats. Are you ready to go? I, uh... I forgot my lines. You... You... Forgot? Your lines? Are you kidding? We made a lot happen for you. We made exceptions for you. And now you're telling me you forgot your lines? I'm sorry. I can make things work. For the things I forget, can I just improvise based on what others are saying? We don't have time for this. We're literally about to start. I'm sorry. It's the brain fog. You'd better think of something. I'd kick you off the set, but you're all we have for the part. This was your debut. This was a huge deal. I know. I'll make it work. I promise. I just wanted to see him. Off with his head. Please, your highness. I meant no harm. Nonsense. You desire that which does not belong to you. You soil royalty with your peasant status. I will leave Underland if you spare my life. Guards, take him away. The play was otherwise good. I didn't have too many nitpicks, except... Except? Byleth was such an asshole. I don't understand how anyone could like his character. I mean, I get it. He's supposed to be charming. He's good looking though. And you forgot about the end where he ended up not being so bad. He's a class hole. There's a difference. And I think he's pretty great. You're biased. You worked with the real him. Well, I'm flattered. I am definitely a class hole. And you're allowed to be... You did good back there. Even if you did flub some of the lines. I know Alec and Underland like the back of my hand. Let's go celebrate. More than happy to. I've been feeling off all day and could use the distraction. Why do I feel like a bitch? Maybe because you got caught in the act. Like always. You're being so nice to me today. What's up? I think you know. You've known for a while now. That feeling you have, it's obvious. None of this is real. Nope, not a thing. Well, except you and me. I'm doing bad again, aren't I? Yes, very bad, but you're starting to get better. It's only a matter of patience. You fell in deep this time, sugar. Really deep and you're crawling out of the equivalent of a deep, dark well. This is just a dream, and it's better than the ones you've had recently. It was still weird, but you're right, it wasn't awful. I woke up reaching out for you. Not literally, but you know. Yes, and I'm flattered, but it's a sign you're coming out of it. And we're going to stay out of it, alright? I don't know if I can this time. Listen, Shane. What you're going through right now is not easy for any human. The world is falling apart, people are dying, idiots are trying to overthrow the government, and there is corruption everywhere. 
you comfort places are inaccessible, you haven't seen a friend in months, and your CPTSD is a beast from isolation. And then people turned against you and acted like children about it. And then were, quite frankly, cruel with their words and that was your last ounce of energy. So then you plummeted under the pressure of not only the world, but your own pain that had been building from years past that you're trying to recover from. And now we're here, and your shadows and nightmares are finally starting to recede. So give yourself and us some damn credit for keeping you alive, because it wasn't easy this time. Because I worry I am everything they said I was. I'm worried I'm a toxic asshole who is an attention whore. I feel like a waste of space and that people would be better off without me. Because some people just think the worst of me and I'm just doing the best that I can. Stop listening to people who use harsh and hateful words and start listening to those who actually want to talk to you and don't think that way of you. You're right. I need to come out of this eventually, but I don't feel like I deserve to. I feel like I deserve to hurt. You do not deserve to hurt, and you deserve to get better, and you deserve love, and you deserve the good friends you do have. But... No, you are not an attention whore either. You just want to be loved. You just want to be heard and understood. Can I ask you something? You will anyway. Can you take me away from here for just a little longer? So I don't have to feel this way for a while. For a little bit. Why don't you back away from that ledge there? I won't do anything. I can't anyway. This isn't reality. I was more hoping you'd come down here. Right. Can we make out? Of course. All that we see or seem is but a dream within a dream.